Hey, what's good, family? Matthew Manuel here. Welcome to week two of the 52-week options trading challenge. My objective here is to grow my portfolio by 10% each week. And if I keep it up by the end of the 52 weeks, it'll be over $28,000. If that's something that interests you, kick back, relax, and enjoy the show. Good morning. Just coming in for a quick update. I uh, wanted to hop in the portfolio, show you where we are to start the week off. All right, so here we are in the handy dandy Robinhood. As you can see, we have $229 buying power and 92 cents. And we took out the money that you saw at the end of uh, last week's episode, but I made one more trade uh, towards the end of that day on, I believe it was QQQ. Just a quick little flip. Uh, we bought a call for $60, sold out for $70. And yeah, we came out with $9.97 profit. So yeah, we have $9.92. I'm about to remove that from the portfolio. We're starting out with $220 when the market opens. So I'm going to move the rest to the bank account. And then by the end of the day, I believe we should have $200. 41, 242, 242 is the goal this week. So that's what we're looking for. What is good family? Week two is in the books and, and believe it or not, we had another successful day. Now let's hop into Handy Danny Robin Hood and take a look. All right. So here we are in the Handy Danny Robin Hood. And as you can see, we already pulled out that money from earlier, that $9.92. So looking here, we should have started with about 220, not including that about a dollar Bitcoin I have. And now we are sitting at 295.91 and we did well today. All right. So uh, looking at it, if we come down, look at AMD, this is what I traded today. And if we come down and look right here, you can see I bought a put for $58 and we sold out for 133. So today we hit a nice home run on that. Uh, we bought in at 242 about 12 minutes in the market open i didn't think i was going to trade today but uh, i saw this set up and quickly hopped in on an opportunity and then we sold out at 253 so we got in 11 minutes and we even have some extra money to throw in the bank we are at 295 so we should have been at 243 so if i'm not mistaken that's almost 50 dollars going to the bank today not a bad day Definitely not mad at that. Now that you saw the trade, of course, now we got to hop in the charts and take a look at what I saw so that you can actually learn something from this. All right. So here we are taking a look at trading view. This is the trade I took today. The one that took 11 minutes. All right. So I entered right here on this candle here. Let's zoom out right here on this candle at 177.72. I rode these candles down. Notice we're on the one minute. This is what I was watching. Rode it all the way down to right here. And I sold out at 175.05. All right. Looking at the charts, you can see we had a supply zone up here. So I was playing off the supply zone. It had this supply zone had been touched up here once, but it wasn't really tapped into. It just kind of sold off at the edge. So the supply zone was still in play. And then right here, I noticed that we had a demand zone right here. Way back there was where the demand zone was created. It tested right here and taking a look at it, I had the trade going as low as down here, but I decided to sell as we were getting close to this demand zone because, because sometimes demand zones, you know, they're good for one touch. This one looks like it was good for two. It may even be good for three, but I, I didn't want to wait and find out. I saw I was up over 100% and I was like, yo, let me take the money and run. This challenge isn't about making massive returns over the span of a week. This challenge is about being consistent, making small little progress every day, every week, and really seeing it compound. When it comes to options, you know, a lot of people, there are people who hit these big 100, 200. I've seen multiple thousand percent returns on options, but a lot of these people aren't consistent. And when you back out and look at it, even if you're able to get something like 2% every week, 3% every week, 
even 1% every week. Once your account's a certain size, 1% becomes massive. 1% of $1,000 is $10. 1% of $10,000, that's $100. Right now I am in Portugal as we make this and averaging $100 a day, being in a trade for 12 minutes, which was actually, you know, that that money I made today was supposed to be for the week and that was 100% or 30% on my account. Imagine when I have a full size account. If I 10X my account or 10X my profits for today, which was the guy was up $70. That would have been a quick $700 just from going from a account size of $220 to $2,200. So of course these things start off slow, but the main thing this challenge is for is to really uh, reinforce and build good habits uh, and show you the power of consistency and build the power of momentum and, and, and really to show us the power of compounding. And with all that being said, if you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Please join the discord. I'm gonna be real with you right now. It is not as active as I'd like. Uh, shout out to the next up, shout out to Darren. Some of y'all in there be messaging me privately, but really my hopes and dreams for the discord is to create a community where not only I'm in there like helping you, I would like to do like free Zoom meetings, so, like workshops and stuff where we can all help each other, where, where I can help share what I know to help y'all become better traders. As long as we got the community going, because that's really what it's all about. I truly want to help you all live your best lives as well. So I really would love if, hey, hop in that Discord, come in there, get active, don't just talk to me, talk to each other, make it a community. And you know, I'd, I'd like to start having voice calls a couple times a week, hopping on Zooms and then, yeah, let's let's make something happen. If you enjoyed this video or learn anything, be sure to smash the like button. If for some reason you're new here and haven't already, be sure to subscribe. And last, but certainly not least, thank you so much for watching. Matthew Manuel signing off, and I want to change your life.